As Alex, we don't even have time to stop as we move into our first teen female competitor, Meredith Kim. They are not messing podium around. Podium at both major world comps in 2022. So she has some experience here. I am, I'm so excited to see these teen females crush this course. Meredith has placed very highly here at Austin Ninjas in the past. Third place in the South Central Regional Standings. Also made it to the last obstacle of Stage 2, which, surprise, was the X Factor. She's about to take it on if she can beat the Spine and the Sidewinders. Well, she's been there before. She knows what to do. Got the experience here, but can she do it under the pressure is the other question. And as our first teen female athlete to go through this course, the other, other two competitors will be watching on, studying how she's approaching this as we line up the, the obstacle that's devastated most of our runs here today. I imagine our teen female competitors will be going for the one side technique. We saw it work for Carrington Andrews in the preteens, but Meredith was only able to get one hand there, didn't have room for her right hand, and came undone again on the X Factor. Yeah, when you're going for that single grab, it really is a tight fit to get both those hands on there. You have to be perfect in your execution. And we can just see here, Meredith just couldn't quite get the landing. Meredith, such a strong resume. Made it to the last obstacle of stage two at this year's world championship. Was on the podium at last year's world championship. Coming out of Iron Sports in Houston, Texas. Now, in order to... See what we need to see again, these first three obstacles of first, of course, Alex, as she takes the double handed approach, getting through that nice and calm, we can breathe a sigh of relief as we now go to work on catching up to Demiana's fifth obstacle run. We saw her sister mainly compete at a high level in mature kids. Meredith would love to do the same. Also says here that she's a competitive cheerleader on the second ranked team in the nation. Well, if Meredith can get this dismount here, I believe she will set the fastest time to obstacle five. And that should secure the win there, Alex, if I'm not mistaken. That sound. Yes, it does. It does. I can confirm that Meredith has secured first place, but with the back half of this course so daunting, you know that that has not crossed her mind at all. She wants that buzzer. Yeah, she's going for that buzzer as we now come into captain's wheel and perhaps one of the most difficult obstacles here on this challenge course. You can see Meredith really having to fight for every single rung here. Well, she makes her way up. But now coming into the dismount, this lachet is proving to be very difficult for our ninjas. There's the jump, makes the catch! Grabs a little bit far in front, though. This is worrisome. Needs to get out of there before she slips off. And she does get out of there. That's a full obstacle ahead of Demiana. Meredith solidly in first place now. Yeah, Meredith has really shown us that she is a worthy ninja. As we... She's going for this completion, Alex. As we come into mega throwback with one minute left on the clock. It'll be interesting to see the approach she takes. Yet another obstacle that has taken out so many top ninjas... It is such a technical obstacle. It requires power, strength, and precision. And let's see if Meredith can pull it off here. No female divisions at the World Championship required this throw move, but that was on stage one. This is Premier Series, and it's a lot harder than a stage one course. Absolutely. As Meredith now gears up for her second and final attempt, she's had a flawless run to this point, and she solidified that first position. But she wants to see how far she can go as we gear up for the second attempt at Mega Throwback. Almost got it! Just fall short. Just missing out on that throwback. But Meredith Kim gets the job done, gets the win, and we will see her up against the best teen females in the world at the Premier Series Finals. Alex, all round, just a solid run. Um, all flawless up until the Mega Throwback. Unfortunately, just couldn't get those grabs there despite coming so close. And yeah, she has solidified herself as a competitor who is going to vie to take that top spot at the Premier Series Finals.